Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Runestone. Today we're we'll going over Magic the Gathering Ley Lines. So let's discover what are Ley Lines. So I thought I would talk about Ley Lines, or sometimes they are referred to as Mana Lines. These ancient paths are on every plane that crisscross the plains flowing with mana. Every Ley Line is enchantment, meaning it is a persistent magical effect. As Ley Lines are found on each plane, Ley Lines can be typically played right away without paying the mana cards with a steaming if the ley line of the quote unquote card is in your opening hand, you may begin the game with it on the battlefield. Some of those little interesting facts about ley lines on different planes, for example, Eldrazi are known to follow ley lines as they are ancient creatures who devour the mana in their endless hunger. On the plane of Zendikar, ley lines have been connected on the hedrons of the plane, which are ancient stone monoliths, which can be used as tools. On this plane, the ancient city of Kor, called the Singing City, could be the focal point of all the ley lines. On the plane of Innistrad, the cryptoliths of the clue stones artifacts were created by the planeswalker Nahir. These were built to bend the ley lines. Nahir wanted to use the ley lines to summon Emakrol. On the plane of Ravnica, the ley lines had created the implicit hate maze. And lastly, and the last little thing about ley lines is the planeswalker Nisa Ravine can actually manipulate these ley lines, which is very unique for a planeswalker. So there's not many much to talk about ley lines, but there is a bit of information on what they can do on each plane. So there are many cards that ley line is represented. The first one obviously being from your kitty and mask, it just says ley line. At the beginning of each player's upkeep, that player may put a plus one, plus one counter on target creature. I'm just gonna say it again, I love ley lines. Next we have is ley line of abundance. And basically, I'm not going to mention the beginning part. If it's the beginning of your hand, you may play it. And amazing how ley lines are so important to the magic lore. It says, whenever you tap a creature for mana, add an additional forest. Pay seven, put a plus one, plus one counter on each creature you control. Next is one of my favorite artworks from of the ley lines is, you may cast a non-land cards as though they had flash. That's just absolutely amazing. You can play that first turn, just this card is perfect. Next we have on the list is ley line of combustion. It says, whenever you're... You and or at least one permanent control becomes a target of a spell. You may have two damage to that player. Then we have Ley Line of Life Force. It says creature spells cannot be countered. Man, that would definitely destroy any blue deck. I just, look at the card too. I really like the artwork by Kev Walker. Then another Ley Line, which is called Ley Line of Lightning. It says whenever you play a spell, you may pay one. If you do, it deals one damage to target player. Next is Ley Line of Punishment. It says players can't gain life, damage can't be prevented. So these are really good sideboards as well as good main cards as well. Next on the list is one of my favorite ley line cards. It says you have hexproof. I know it's very particular, but as you guys know, white is my favorite color out of all the magic cards being used with the whole defense. Perfect. Next on our list is ley line of singularity. It says all non-land permanents are legendary. Definitely you can make a deck with that one. Next is Leyline of the Meat. It says creature tokens get plus one, plus one, where strength and humility converge. Next we have is Leyline of the Void. It says if a card be put into an opponent's graveyard from anywhere, exile it instead. And that's pretty cool because it says opponent's graveyard. And last of the Leyline cards in all the magic world at the time of this video is creatures you control get plus zero, plus one. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield, you gain one life line of vitality so there are a few cards that ley lines are associated with not actually being ley line cards and as you can see from the first one it's pretty obvious ley line binding so these ley lines are holding the monster in place it is associated not represented in so there are a few cards so let's start we did ley line bind. let's get to the next card which is ley line of innovation it says do you still believe my work is nothing but dry anyway uh, the card itself, pretty explanatory. Then we have Leyline Phantom. Basically, it's pretty obvious this Phantom is around the Leylines, and it's on every plane of Magic the Gathering World. It's such a basis for that. Next card we have is Leyline Prowler. It has Death Touch, Life Link, and Add One Mana of any color because, again, Leyline Prowler. It's pretty obvious, pretty cool, and pretty interesting. And the last card Leylines are associated with is Leyline Tyrant. Pretty simple and pretty obvious. 
So the next set of cards is Ley Lines are recorded or referred to, and this one being from Ancient Ziggurat from the DCI Friday Night Magic. It says Ley Lines branch out from the foundation like roots from a tree. They draw mana from every region, welcome all living things into its verdant catacombs. Next is Bonds of Mortality. It says Jace discovered the Ley Line pattern need to anchor Ulamog and Kozilek to the reality, but it was Nisa who could trace it on her world. Next is Maze Behemoth, and it says, It returned to the ley lines as quickly as it appeared, leaving only broken bodies to mark its passage. And we got out Mythic. It's called Persilus Vault. It costs four mana. It says, The spirit dragon Ugin arranged the hedrons of Zendikar to direct the ley lines of energy. To disrupt one is to unleash the devastation and chaos. And last but not least, we have Skin Brand Goblin. from actually the Double Master series, anyways. The gruel skin ruins discern whether the patterns evoke streets, ley lines, or both. You have four days. And that is all the cards and information on ley lines. So I hope you guys have a good day and a good evening.